Welcome to today's episode of the Lions Roar News. Fun fact, the first college football game was played on November 6, 1869 in New Brunswick, New Jersey. The boys basketball team has a game today at Greenup and Thursday at Bath. The girls basketball team has a game tomorrow at Nicholas. These are the last games for both teams before districts. Make sure to cheer them on from the stands or at home. There will be softball tryouts today after school. The softball team is also selling t-shirts and hoodies ranging from youth small to adult 3x. T-shirt prices range from $12 to $14 and hoodies are $25. Chromebook checkouts are now only before first period or during and they must be returned that day in seventh period or immediately after school. For anyone who wishes to purchase a yearbook, they are on sale for $60. Order forms can be picked up at the office or in the library until May 1st and you can also order online at yearbookforever.com until the end of the school year. Popcam Valentine orders have been finalized and will be delivered this week. Tutoring will be in Miss Sullivan's room every Tuesday and Thursday, 3 to 5.30 p.m., and buses will run. Don't forget about the Mac and Via Reading Challenge. The student and teacher who reads the most books in Mac and Via in the month of February will win a prize. So hop on the Mac and Via app and start reading. The lunch menu for this week is today, tacos, Wednesday, hot dogs, Thursday is chili day, and Friday is barbecue pulled pork. This week's weather predictions are mostly sunny with rain showers on Thursday. Temperatures will range from high 30s to low 60s. That's a wrap for today's edition of the Lions Roar News. We will leave you with a short clip of Logan Lyle's 1,000 point club highlights. Go Lions!